Vladi Kolawani. I'm the CEO of LNL Foods, the manufacturers of Mr. Aircraft. I started out as a response to uh, a desire to start a business. Um, so me and my co-founder decided that we want to take our decisions into our own hands. And so around that time, I started doing a lot of research about agriculture because I felt that to start a business, you need to add value. So we started trying to understand the problems in the agricultural sector. And one trend we saw was that the further up the value chain you go, the, the better and more sustainable the business is. You know? But we also realized that in Nigeria, you don't have a lot of value addition. So most people just trade. So we said, all right, what products can we add value to? And so we initially wanted to start with processing cashews. And you know, there was then a light bulb moment where we realized that the granite value chain is very underdeveloped. So as you know, most granites are sold in used bottles. There's not a lot of commercial activity there. So we said, all right, we think we can create a sustainable business, you know, producing high quality granites. Nigeria, interestingly, it's not, it's not been very difficult. I mean, from the first day, we've always had more demand than ability to supply. I mean, the reason is because we have a large population. A lot of our needs are currently not being met. So, we, you know, so the truth is there's a big market and a lot of the producers are small scale. Um, but the other thing we've been able to do is differentiate our product. So we have a sugar coated version. We also have, you know, good packaging. So there's the hygiene factor. Um, there's also the fact that psychologically people like to go back to the familiar. So rather than, you know, hope you're buying a good bottle of granite, you know you can look for the Mr. Epper pack. You know, so there's that, you know, stick a bit, stickiness that comes from branding as well. Uh, I mean, it's simple. So we, you know, we source granules from farmers, we bring it to our factory, we process it, clean it, package it um, properly, and then sell to retail stores. So ShopRite, Spa Game, but we also sell to the open market. So Okari, you know, some of it in the north as well. So I mean, it's a very simple model, source from farm, process and sell to retailer. Uh, so I think for me, I, one thing I learned is that people are primarily emotional before they're rational. So we all try to think, we believe we're rational beings, but you hardly ever hear a person say, I didn't like that guy, but I bought what he was selling. So the truth is, relationships matter in any deal. Um, so building rapport with the counterparty matters. The other thing is, I think it's important to walk into a deal knowing your walkaway point. So be clear what it is you're willing to give up and I mean you should be willing to consider some so kind of know what your walk away point is if not you might end up buying the product too high or selling too low so I think those two are important you know build relationships but also kind of going with a clear strategy in five years we see ourselves being the market leader of the granite industry so when people think granite we want them to think we stack bar we also see ourselves doing approximately 35 million dollars in revenue so essentially that means growing our reach outside the southwest, you know, the north, and just kind of growing across Nigeria um, and increasing our product portfolio, so other peanut-related snacks.